Hi, my name is Cassie Mahadi, and I'm an Emerald Director with Sensations and Mia Bella Candles. And I was asked to share my candle story with you, which began 20 years ago when my daughter, Shaylin, was first born. So I thought it would be fun to have her join me during my storytelling because this is what 20 years later looks like. Uh, it was a uh, it was a strong desire of mine to be able to stay home and raise her myself. At the time, I had been an uh, employment counselor, social worker for the county's human services. And I just knew that it was something that I needed to do, that I needed to be there. And so this business has allowed me to do that. Uh, she was never in daycare. I was able to uh, be there with her every day and her brother, her older brother, and participate in their lives. And that was really, she's why I began this candle business. Um, we started out doing some retailing in the early days at farmer's markets. And she just, she loved being a part of that uh, as a four, five, six year old, uh, going out and handing out scent samples and asking people if they wanted to smell our candles and introducing them to, to this unique clean burning candle. Uh, we weren't necessarily candle lovers 20 years ago, but once this product was introduced to us, we've been candle fanatics ever since. Um, here, we even have one on the table here. You can see the clean, even burn. Once I realized this is what a candle could be, uh, it was easy to sell the product. Uh, the scents are phenomenal and that's that's all you have to do is let people smell. Um, then we expanded beyond the retailing into the team building aspect. Uh, we've got team members all over the United States and Canada and it's just been so much fun to be able to do business with partners. Uh, that's one of my favorite parts of the business is being able to coach and mentor others to develop their own business. Um, so that is an area that you can participate in or not. With Sensations, you have the ability to choose what you wanna do with your business. Uh, one of our fastest growing aspects of the methods of building your business is our fundraising program. Um, it's been wonderful to help organizations earn the funds that they need to support their missions while sharing the candle and having a good time. Uh, Shaylin was the uh, VP of philanthropy of her sorority group. And so we, we created, she created the custom label that is just a really unique aspect of sensations that we're able to create these very unique labels and put it on any candle scent that we want. So she had created this for her sorority, signifying that, you know, real strong women. Uh, they brought that then to one of their um, events where they sold them and uh, the profits then went to the group who was able then to share them with a domestic violence awareness group that their sorority supports. And so that's been a real big hit. Uh, so again, we have many ways of doing business, retailing, team building, fundraising. You can choose one or all of the methods, whatever will work for you. Um, you know, and the business has, has allowed us to be actively involved for many, many years, but then there have been times where I needed to step back from my business for various health reasons with my family, uh, things that just I needed to take care of when family came first and my business allowed me to do that. And then once those crises were over, I could jump back into rebuilding my business. So it, it's a business that you can build at your pace, your time and uh, take it as far as you want. You can do it part-time, you can do it full-time, which really still is only 15, 20 hours a week. Um, but it's just been a phenomenal blessing to my family and the fact that I got to be home with Shaylin all those years. So if that is something that you are interested in, in you know, finding out more about the candle, the business opportunity, and our corporate uh, staff back in Wilkes-Barre, you know, get back with the person who invited you to watch the story. See if uh, they can get your questions answered and maybe it's something that you would like to join us. And then 20 years from now, maybe you'll tell us your story.